Hey, this will be a video chart on ticker symbol FNMA. We will take a look at the daily time frame. Done this one multiple times, and last time I did it, I believe it was after this big red day here, and you can see that things since then have recovered nicely. And then today, I uh, had some more profit taken and such, but still holding up fine. And it's assuming that you are in this for uh, the overall chart, meaning you didn't, you weren't a day trader thinking you're going to sell, you know, a few minutes later and you bought up there, then the chart's still totally fine. Uh, so again, a matter of perspective, day traders, things might not be looking too good for you if you bought up there, but. Overall picture, overall uh, kind of trend, whatever you want to call it, things are still uh, looking fine and you know in the bull's favor. So, a couple things here: the lines that you see drawn are, are all from previous videos that I've done. I'm not going to go into depth where they came from. If you want to, you know, get that information, just go back in the video archives and you can watch some of the previous videos. But in terms of updating the lines that are here, no updates need to be made. This level here. Uh, was a resistance last time I did it and then you can see when the price did get above it here you can see two days in a row acted as support so a great example of a resistance turning into a support but then today the price did close back below it so therefore this level is still a level of resistance so if anything I'll just extend this over here same with these lines uh, great example here I mean look at that nailed that support and I, again I have not touched this line and you can see it dropped down there and bounced exactly off of that level of support so one of those things where if you don't believe that charts really work pretty hard to argue when you see stuff like this so uh, you know these two levels remain the uh, levels of support nice to see that the price was or this level right here was able to hold as support and then bounce the uh, price back up uh, later on in the day so again as long as these levels of support continue to hold no worries from the overall chart picture. And I know I drew this trend line last time. Just want to get up there uh, again. This is the key level. Uh, you know, heck, even if this level were to fail, you still do have the 50 day cent moving average. But, you know, definitely a best case scenario, you want this trend line here to be able to continue to hold strong. Obviously, price isn't even close to it. But if it were to come down here, as long as this holds, then that implies that the chart is putting in those higher lows. And that's what we want to see. Resistance wise, straightforward, this level right here we'll call uh, at 225, 226 is the level of resistance, and then that high up there at 268, uh, 270, whatever you want to call it, is the other level of resistance. But, you know, after the questions I got, nothing to panic about, and there will be nothing to panic about as long as these supports keep holding like they've been doing. So, all in all, everything's still, uh, you know, definitely in the favor of the bulls. If there are any other questions though on the chart, please let me know. If not, if you enjoy the video and want to learn more about charting and how to use it in your strategy as a trader, I'd encourage you to click up below on that, uh, or up above, excuse me, on that image, and it'll take you to our store. Whether you're new to charts or are looking for some advanced uh, information, we have uh, different downloadable courses there for you, all instant downloads, so you can get started literally today if you so choose. So I'd encourage you to check those out. One more time, this was FNMA. Thanks for listening.